On December 1st of 2023, the Georgia Bulldogs were considered unbeatable. They had a 12-0 record. They were number one in the polls. But a day later, they lost 27-24 to Alabama in the SEC title game, and they missed the playoffs. Will Georgia get their revenge in 2024? Well, we're going to talk about it, but before we do, i got to tell you about a promotion we have available at wagertalk.com. From now until August 31st, you can get all my football picks. That's college football, NFL, and NFL preseason until the end of September for one low price of 249 bucks. Why would you be interested in that? Well, I do my homework over the summer, and the results have been outstanding. 41 and 12 with college football at 77%. In August and September, the last two years, 75% winners with college, NFL, and NFL preseason. You can get that deal at wt.buzz slash deals. That's the Wager Talk deals page. But you don't have to feel obligated to purchase anything. You don't need to give me any money. The only thing I ask from you is that you smash that like button, and that will ensure that I can keep on putting out these videos. Now let's get into the free pick. We got Georgia as a 13 and a half point favorite against Clemson in week one in Atlanta. The total sits at 48 and a half. And man, that line really jumps out at you, 13 and a half. When's the last time you've seen Dabo Swinney's Clemson Tigers getting 13 and a half points? But um, they're an underdog for a reason. Georgia gets Carson Beck back. And Beck was really coming to, into his own at the end of last season. And then they uh, hit the transfer market for a running back. Trevor Etienne comes over from Florida. And this is a team that, sure, they lost a few players to the NFL draft, but with five straight top five recruiting classes, two of those being number one classes, you can be assured that the players coming in to replace those guys are more than likely going to be five-star recruits. Uh, the bookmakers are optimistic about Georgia. They've set their season win total at 10.5, juice to the over and they're a minus 600 favorite to make the college football playoffs. Clemson, on the other hand, the bookmakers are not optimistic about them. They're an underdog to make the playoffs, and I think there's a good reason for that. Uh, the uh, Clemson camp is saying that this is going to be the year that quarterback Cade Klubnick comes into his own, but uh, call me a skeptic. I've heard that before. Last year, they brought in offensive coordinator Garrett Riley, and that was supposed to make all the difference. That didn't pan out. Um, it's tough to see them really putting it together in week one in a hostile environment against perhaps the best team in the country. And speaking of week one, what did we see out of Clemson last year in week one? Well, they went on the road and lost to Duke, got blown out in embarrassing fashion, clearly uh, not prepared for what they faced against Duke. And it's not going to get any easier here against the Georgia Bulldogs. Uh, previous meetings between these teams, in 2021, uh, Clemson lost at home by a score of 10 to 3. And then the last time they played Georgia in Georgia, 45 to 21 loss back in 2014. That was a long time ago now, but uh, I'm going to lean with uh, Kirby Smart and the Georgia Bulldogs. I'm going to lay it. I say the Bulldogs get it done and win this game by at least two touchdowns. If you like this video, smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel, and if you've got anything to say to me, even if it's nasty, you hit me up in the comments below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can.